So the idea for the hideaway video came to me while I was on the train from Moscow to St. Petersburg and I was, uh, it was like an overnight ride and I was brainstorming the whole night, wrote down the ideas and when I came back to New York um, I called up Karina who ended up being our director for the video, Karina Kandel, and she, you know, got on with the concept right away and she was like, oh this is cool, let me think about it and then she called me back and she added some cool like things uh, that uh, I didn't expect. For example, um, the thing with the hideaway where like all the pa papers start crawling on me. On top of me, that was her idea. She really wanted to try to do the stop motion thing. And I was like, totally, let's do it. For me, it's important that um, the actual idea the, like, comes from me. And then I brainstorm on it with someone else, like I collaborate on my idea. When it comes to following the concepts, I usually trust Oli's intuition. She's always got a very clear vision um, about where to go. And a lot of that entails sometimes just having the time mentally to let those ideas flow in and then see where they evolve. Oftentimes I'll uh, lend my two cents here and there for we might need some extra extension cords or perhaps we can tape up the glitter stars like this etc and um, handle things more in like a logistics uh, angle so that's makes a, I think a nice balanced partnership every like director that comes to collaborate with us on, on Scarlet sales videos they have their own take on our house basically because we use our house for like a, a lot of you know three or four, four, four videos now but you can cannot tell like people who watch the videos they're like oh that's cool like where did you shoot this i mean like it's the same place but it's cool how like a person's vision can just you know completely transform it into something different we found somewhere close to 12 or 15 paintings that were sort of hidden away by a prior housemate 20 years ago i mean like huge canvases that we sort of strewn about the set in the background and lit the whole thing with Christmas lights and so to see the way that looks on camera was really exciting too and to know that a, a bit of the history of the place where we live made it in. Yeah, well, it was really exciting seeing the final uh, cut for the, uh, for the first time. We've done four videos, I think, three or four videos um, at this big crazy brownstone where we live and just to see the house transform every time in a new magical, esoteric, strange way is, is always exciting too. And uh, yeah, uh, Karina just captured some really beautiful scenes with Oya and, and the band downstairs. It was my first time working with Karina and she achieved more than I expected. She did such an amazing job with everything that uh, we were both thrilled and there were just a couple of little things that we wanted to tweak. And the rest of it was pretty much perfect. <laughs>